hello guys today in this tutorial i will basically show you a video editor that i built using next.js using ffmpg webassembly library inside browser so you can see that guys this is my interface of the application video cutter we need to simply select this button as you select this button you will be able to select your video file that you want to trim or cut and we will have a timeline editor as you select the video file so now let me select this video file so you will see that guys the video will play right here and now we have this timeline automatically created for the video as you select the video guys automatically the timeline will be created this is a timeline user interface which is there and with the help of this timeline you can easily trim out the portion that you want you need to cut the portion so we don't need to provide the start and end duration we can simply select it using the timeline duration so we can select like this so this will so whatever portion that you want to select so in here you can see basically the time interval this is 2 2 minute 33 second and 3 minute 36 so this time period I need to trim so if I need to trim this portion I just need to click this button right here which is given below click on trim so now your video has been successfully trimmed guys so you can see that how fast this has taken place so we are executing ffmpg in the browser guys using webassembly library and we have used next.js for this purpose and now we can download the video trimmed video so now your video has been downloaded guys if you see and if I open this video right here, your video will be trimmed. So the total length of the video is one minute. The trimmed video, you will see that the video will play like this. So in this way, guys, you can easily trim a video and play it inside the video player as well. It will show you the result before you download. So if you need the full source code of this application, guys, I have built it with my full dedication and hard work. So uh, you can go to the description of the video where you will find out the payment links You can go to PayPal and make the payment in United States dollar or you can go to stripe and make the payment in Indian rupees uh, So both the payment links are given in the description of the video and uh, this is a nice little interface if you want to go back and uh, Make some changes. So let like, suppose I want to trim this portion click on trim So once again your video will be trimmed you can see now only 36 seconds will be there you will see 36 seconds so in the background guys we are actually executing ffmpg you will see in the background ffmpg has been executing uh, using webassembly library and uh, then we can download this video you can see that so we are actually using this library if you don't know about ffmpg webassembly wasm this is a basically a package or utility library which is used to execute ffmpg library in the browser so if you don't know about ffmpg it's a audio and video processing library or open source so this is their official documentation their website you can it's a command line library but uh, webassembly library is specifically designed to use this inside the browser to make these media intensive applications to make video editors in the browser so similarly we built it inside next.js so after you purchase the full source code guys you will actually get this uh, uh, package uh, this uh, zip file you just need to extract the zip file and after that you will basically get all this uh, source code so we built it inside typescript guys so you will see all the type all the files will have the extension which is tsx this is typescript and uh, you can see that so we have all the code right here which is available to you after you basically uh, do this what we need to do the npm i so this will basically install all the modules after that you just need to run the command npm run dev so this will run the dev script npm run dev so this will run your application on local host 3000 we can even build out the application as well npm run build it's where you can deploy this application right here on your own website so we are running this local host 3000 so after that it will need to select your video file after that it will automatically build the timeline as you select the video file you will see 
So now you can select any portion that you want to select to actually cut the video or trim the video. So this is a very nice interface that you can see right here. So if you're interested guys, the links are given in the description. You can purchase the full source code and get this application. It's a very good application, trimming app, video trimming and cutter application in the browser using FFMPG WebAssembly library. And you can even download the resultant file. You can see your file has been downloaded and then you can play the file. So please hit that like button guys, subscribe the channel as well. And I will be seeing you in the next video. Until then, thank you very much.